We have a new Danger Zone leak, but it might not be what you guys are expecting. And if you didn't know, all Danger Zone items from CSGO were actually leaked for CS2 as well. And it was not just code references, we actually have the full models working in game, as you can see in the background of the video. The actual game mode for Danger Zone is fully functional inside CS2 as well, as game followers showed a few months ago and as you can see in the video, and we also had these colored smoke leaks a while ago which were rumored to be a new feature inside Danger Zone. And if that's not enough, we had so many mentions of the word survival in the game files and if you didn't know, survival is basically the code name that the CS2 developers gave to Danger Zone, so anytime they mention survival, what they actually mean is Danger Zone. And with all of this, everyone and their mom thought that Danger Zone was coming back to CS2, but that might not be the case according to a new leak that we just got. But before we go into that one, this video was brought to you by Skins Monkey, where you can trade your boring old skins for brand new ones. Are you tired of your blue combo? Just trade it for a red one, it takes seconds. Use code OSNICS on the website to get $5 for free to trade and you also get a 35% deposit bonus. They have 24-7 live chat support, link is in the description and thank you Skins Monkey for sponsoring the video. So Neo Kai posted this tweet today in which he basically says he got told by a source that Danger Zone is not coming to CS2. If you want to believe it, it's up to you, but I actually knew Neo way before this post, so I asked him if he was trolling or if he actually had this information and he told me that he actually does and this is not a troll whatsoever and that the source for the information is very good and that this source was actually told this news on Danger Zone by Valve themselves. So the reason given for this Danger Zone decision is that Danger Zone wasn't really popular enough to justify spending so much time working on it for CS2 because as you can imagine Danger Zone is not an easy game mode to get functional and the amount of people that actually played it apparently was very small. Again, take this with a grain of salt, neither I or Neo can verify this information but if he tells me that his source is credible I have no reason to believe otherwise. And obviously this is not super surprising because I personally really like Danger Zone but most people just played it like once a week and then never touched it for like a month so the game mode was not super popular. This doesn't mean that Danger Zone is never coming back and if these leaks are true it just means that it's not a priority at the moment and will not come back anytime soon. And honestly it might be for the best because with the current cheating situation in CS2, Danger Zone lobbies would be an absolute nightmare. It would only take one cheater to absolutely ruin the match for dozens of people. And Valve is definitely aware of this and this could also have contributed to their decision. But speaking of cheaters, the professional footballer Neymar, which I'm sure most of you know, loves to play Counter-Strike, but he has been having some issues. It started when he posted this video saying that he was playing some CS and this happens and you can see in the video that he's just getting killed by someone rage hacking and just a day later he then tweeted that CS2 is trash at the moment because there's a lot of cheaters. And keep in mind this is one of the most popular people on the planet so this is not a good look for Valve at all and even though the cheating situation has gotten much better than it was a few months ago he still needs a lot of work. And last news for the day, this guy posted his genius idea to change CS2 on Reddit, in which the T's are basically able to sell the bomb for money. So if you guys want to read it, I think it's very interesting, pause the video, go ahead and read it and let me know what you think about it down in the comments. That is it for today, like and subscribe for daily CS2 news.